Alrighty. So, previously on the Cave Crawlers, you guys managed to talk to the king, found out a little bit about the political situation going on in this kingdom, at least love triangle-wise. And you finally figured out the name to a certain dragon you met earlier. Afterwards, at the insistence of Koalia, you guys found the most questionable inn you could locate. And spent the night there. During the night, Koalia felt her foot move, so she went down to investigate. And literally scared a human to death Ew. through some very nice rolls and some quick thinking from Denki. You actually managed to bring the character to life only to nearly kill them again. <laughs> you then find out that this is this person is called Lionel Wise, a 13-year-old human boy who is a street urchin and has proven themselves adept to be a level one rogue. I can't with and the fucking whistle. <laughs> what was that? I can't with the whistle and Soggy's I know! I fucking hate it! <laughs> you need I'm you sorry. need a noise canceller. canceler. <laughs> Just slap that on your door and close the door. Oh, the door is closed. He's outside right now and my window is closed. My window no. is a thing that is not soundproof. Well, yeah, you take the noise canceller and you put it on every surface the noise is coming through and it cancels the noise. So if you put a noise canceller on your window, no noise can come through the window. Like I could be have a megaphone on the other side and you wouldn't hear me. I don't know how that works, but <laughs> it detects the oscillation of the window and counters the oscillation so that way there's no noise coming through. Interesting. Nice. Yep. Anyway, back to D and D world. Sorry, I'm a techie, it's what I do. Um oh, wait, Bill. Sorry, never mind. What's up, thank you? Could you actually send me how to find send that noise canceling shit? Or a link to it? Can you send the noise? Yeah, sure. yeah. later yeah, can thanks. you send it to me too? Yeah. Yep. Just... I'll slap it into the D&D chat when I have it sometime. Thank you. Since there's multiple of you who want it. Just be warned, I haven't had the chance to test it myself, so I would consider this prototype tech. <laughs> okay. So, buyer beware. Anyway, moving on. So you found out that this poor street urchin has really not had the best upbringing, if you can even call it an upbringing. And they have already formed a bit of a bond with uh, Smokey, for already calling dad, uh, Smokey Dad. And with that, it's getting close to noon in game. It's a little dreary out. Might be raining later in the day, but the day is yours. What do you want to do, Cape Crawlers? Can I buy a gem? <laughs> you want to go to a gem shop? Yeah. Yes. But what about? It's all part of my master plan. I need a gem. <laughs> but shouldn't we go to that one thing in the middle of the island thing? The academy. Yes, the academy. That's an academy record. I need a gem. I wish someone would get that reference. Okay, so does anybody else have any objections about going to a gem shop first? Mm-mm. All right. Uh, let's start out with the rolls. Okay, Smokey. Go ahead and roll a investigation check to see how long it takes you to find a gem shop. 18. It does not take you long at all. <laughs> Sweet. Okay. That's an academy record. So you enter the shop. What you looking for? Hmm. Hold on. One second. Ah, uh, okay. Hey, I want to. I. I want to go talk to the shopkeep. Okay, you walk up to the shopkeep. He's this older-looking druid. Hey, man. What's up? 
I'm not laughing in character. I'm just I got the giggles. Oh. It's all right. Let me see. <laughs> Yay! Hey, oh, hey. oh my God! Hello. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. It's You're finally four, alive. Holy it's shit! It's alive. I had to. Walk, I had to wake myself up. Hello. Hey, Annie. Anyway. Right. I'm trying to find the page. So, hey. was Hemi there for the... for Lionel? I don't know what's going on. I just got dragged. Was no, Lionel that. He wasn't. Just, like, just then he said Zio as soon as okay. uh, he just said so, something. Recap for yesterday's session. I'm going to do the recap again just for Hemi. So, you guys arrived at the castle of the king. You entered, told him about your situation at Newport, and you also found out the name of the dragon you had met earlier. Because it turns out the dragon is actually a regular visitor to the king's castle. Um, afterwards to investigate Qualia decided that she wanted to spend the night at the most questionable inn possible and not even spend the extra five silver to lop her unconscious body into a room and so y'all left her in the cart for the night about 2am Qualia felt her physical body's leg move so she went down to investigate she found a human going through the cart and used her specter abilities to literally scare the human to death. She killed him. All I said was boo. Thank you, <laughs> Coralia. That's all. And that's when Qualia and Denki, or Smokey, Denki's new character, he's dead, found out that the human in question was a 13-year-old boy. Smokey, through some ingenious use of magic and medical, actually managed to restart the boy's heart and get bring him back to life. And then Kuala almost killed him again. Almost. Almost. Smokey, through some more magic bullshit, managed to save the kid. Magic bullshit. <laughs> Oh, you're talking I, about Hamlet? I'm sorry, but to a degree, bo both of the both Qualia accidentally almost killing him again because of the natural one, and then you using your your magic hand to catch him, it's a bit of magic bullshit. No, no, I, I'm not, no, I agree. I, I don't know. I thought I All I goddamn wanted to do was just sorry. speak to him, not kill him <laughs> again. Natural one is natural one, though. No, my main problem is that fucking um. Uh... Squeak up and be like, please fail, please fail, please fail. <laughs> and then I failed. And then he was like, wow. Yep. And so, Smokey spending about 20 ish gold through not just Smokey, but other players mm -hmm. helped out. Ended up finding out that the boy is named Lionel Wise. And he's actually proficient enough at sneaking around that he is a level one rogue. After spending the morning with the boy investigating his surroundings, you quickly realize that he was a street urchin who did not have the best upbringing. And the group has decided to adopt him, so we now have a sixth member. Well, not the but group, the more NPC. of think he adopted him. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I dare any of the players to say they don't want to adopt that kid after that situation, though. I mean, I don't want to <laughs> adopt him, but I do want him part of the, part of the party. Bruh. <laughs> there's a difference. Uh, no, there's very okay. little difference in D&D. I, I know what I want to do, though. I'm good. I got everything all set. Okay. So, yeah, that's what happened last session. You catch all that, Hammy? Yes. <laughs> any thoughts? Uh, well, give me one second. Uh, 
Here's my thought. Hold on, I'm gonna send it in a minute. <laughs> oh dear. You, my bloody god. I can't stop grinning, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> that's how that's how amazing my plan is. It's just I can't stop grinning. I'm scared. <laughs> I wish I had a prop gun, but I have a controller, so I'm gonna pretend like that's a gun and just point at you. Oh no, Here. I'm so scared, it won't stop my- Look at the D&D <laughs> ult. And he reloads a 50 gauge shotgun with malicious intent. What are you gonna <laughs> do with the shotgun? Here, no, sorry. Danny. Okay. So anyway, Smokey. Hey. What you doing, Smokey? Got the giggles. Shit. I'd like to buy a name at this. Aim for the kid. <laughs> oh, wait, hold on! <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo, not the Nani? Oh my, what? Do shinde do. One <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So. What? <laughs> you block. Okay. Can I buy an amethyst, please? That's, that's what I want. That's what I You want to buy an amethyst? Ho okay, hold oh, on. Yes. This is gonna be a great plan. You guys are gonna be so amazed with what I'm doing. Watch it fail. It's not. I'm gonna fail. I can't fail. That's how great it is. It's gonna fail. Watch. <laughs> okay. Go ahead and roll a persuasion check to figure out how much it's gonna be. Oh, wait. Fuck. Roll. I'll. Aw, oh, buddy. Oh. <laughs> no, it's fine. I'll I'll do it. I'll pay for my. Oh, holy! I almost got it now. Oh, <laughs> buddy. Whatever. It's fine. Oh, wait, that's not even the right one, bro. <laughs> there we go, buddy. There we none go. Of, none yeah. of these are right. <laughs> wait, no. <laughs> there. Oh my god, buddy. You just oh, wasted it two incredibly like, good I really did. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> That's so sad. That didn't happen to every Volson type. <laughs> it's gonna run you 120 gold pieces. For a, for a gemstone of Amethyst. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm fine with that. Okay. I'll, take, I'll take that. <laughs> Wait, have, have we leveled up, or... No. Are we all still at level 3? Yes, you're still at level 3 right. for the moment. Can all I right. put a amethyst? Yep. Go ahead and put in your inventory. And make sure you and... deduct 120. No! Oh, that reminds me, yeah. Cammy, you did get rewarded for completing the main quest, so your gold amount has been updated to reflect your new in income. You are very what? rich now. Oh! Hold on. I'm not doing anything. I'm not. What? There we go. Okay. And for I'm the record, gonna... oh. Denki, it could have been yes. worse if you were. If the absolute worst case scenario, it would have cost you 200 gold pieces. Yeah, I almost got it on that one. On the last one. Because <laughs> oh. um. Amethyst okay. is a level and 3 then... gemstone, so. Oh. That's fine. I got 500 gold, it's fine. <laughs> okay. What... And now, now that I, <laughs> I had like two voice tracks there, and now that I have the amethyst, I'm gonna use my infusion serving skills on it. For a homunculus it... servant. What are you gonna Turned infuse it monkey. with? Huh? What are you gonna uh, infuse it with? Homun... Uh, a homunculus monkey? servant. No. A homunculus <laughs> servant. Yes. I'm gonna slap into your character sheet here for a second to figure out what you're doing. <laughs> Features and traits. It's 
Yeah, it's just gonna be so good. Just trust me on this. I love how he keeps on coming <laughs> in and out. Oh, I got yeah. Shit, Wi-Fi right now. Pauses, and then like a couple of things later, I finish. Where is it in your in your? Is it class features? It's a uh, troll down on inventory. It should be well, the second infusion I can do. Oh, it's in, your infusions are in here. Hmm? It should be. Wait a minute. What? What color the skin is going to be your servant? I don't know. <laughs> Why? Color. I didn't. Rainbow. <laughs> huh? Wait. I don't know. Yeah. Purple. I guess. <laughs> well. Rainbow. I'll, I have. I have a photo. You're in gonna mind. be using an amethyst, a a gem, to create a servant. I know Correct. exactly what you're making a reference to. Uh -huh. You be so very, very what am I making careful, a to? buddy. Wait. What am I making a reference to? Wait. What? Thieving mm -hmm. Universe? Oh! <gasps> no, 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 actually, oh, I wasn't no. referencing that at all. No, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I actually wasn't referencing that. No, oh, God, no, no, no. That's oh, not what I'm doing. Oh, no. my God. Uh, hold on. I'm trying to make... It's even worse. You picked purple. That is Amethyst's color. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> That's hold because on. Amethysts are purple. Like, what? No, I'll, I'll show you what I'm trying to make. Hold on. I'm not trying to make you amethyst, dude. <laughs> oh my god. Are you We're, trying I to make a punchy on. boy? No, I'm trying to make a little dragon, dude. <laughs> I said to Oh. No. I thought you were trying to make a I punchy said, boy. Teen, teen, teen. I just want one of those guys. That's all I want. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, I don't want. That's all I want. <laughs> okay. Are you sure I, I that you're that. not trying <laughs> but, to like, make purple. Yes. the world? I'm not trying to make... No, I'm not trying to make Star Platinum the world no stop let them the world <laughs> okay and then can i infuse it because i really want distraction <laughs> okay so describe what your your homunculus looks like to us is it just uh, that picture yeah it's just a photo but I want purple to see color scheme instead. It's in okay. D&D &D chat. Yeah. Oh. That's what I wanted. <laughs> I shoot that little dragon with a 50k shotgun, please. Oh, <laughs> God damn it. Bro. Um, mark that you've used an infusion. You got it. Should be in your spells. Uh, or sorry, it features the trait. Yeah, I got it. Thank you. Yep. <gasps> okay. Oh my god! I got a daddy dragon. <laughs> I'm so happy. Okay. Anyway, that's it. I'm 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 good now. All right. I'm done with that bit. <laughs> uh, yeah. No. Does stop. Anybody oh else my have, god. <laughs> does anybody else have any uh business at the gym shop? No. No. Do you think I could scare them into giving us more gems? No. This is just a passing oh, no. thought that I wanted to say. No, I don't want to get you arrested. You can most I'm certainly good. try. Yes, but I'm not going to try. I just wanted to voice it. I'm your DM. It's not for me to influence you on this. I'm not. I was just saying, hey, here's a funny thought that I had. Not... Hey, I'm gonna do the stupid thing. So y'all just not gonna question how I have a fucking floating piece of metal now to you guys? No. I'm... It's a t it's a tiny looking dragon about the size of a bird. Can I give it head pads? <laughs> Can I use life and bolt at it? No. <laughs> if you do, I will steal your money. Can so, I lose multiple guys involved? For the head pads, Qualia, you would have to ask Smokey. Smokey, can I give your dragon some head pads? It looks know. like a good dragon. 
And then, Danny, do you actually want to shoot it? No, 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 I'm fucking with you. Just, I just woke fucking up. Fucking better not. Baby Go dragon. <laughs> um, I just woke up. I'm not fair gonna enough. look at it. I look good, Cora, yeah. I'm gonna give it a cold shoulder and just play. You stop play. talking like that, sure! <laughs> So we have two of your teammates. I wanna, nice. I want to give it's it a, a nice uh, little head pat, and then like you know, kind of like a cat. Okay. Oh like a little like scrubbing of the cheek. What happens when she goes to pet it, Smokey? <laughs> oh wait, I can decide. Oh. It's no. your servant. You need to tell us its personality oh. and how it reacts. Oh yeah. Okay, hold on. You're gonna make it bite huh. me, aren't you? Is there like a jet? Uh, Personality generator, really? Because <laughs> I don't want to come over to the with that. I don't want to. Okay, I'll do it for you then. Wait, no, 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 wait, wait. I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't want that. Hold on. <laughs> no, wait. Hold on. Okay, I'll, I'll decide. Um. <laughs> tick tock, tick tock. <laughs> tick tock on the clock. Uh, personality gen. <laughs> He's literally taking it then. I'm not looking up a personality generator. I don't know what you mean. Ten. Nine. <laughs> wait, okay, hold eight, on. Uh, seven. Wait, it's not six, generating! It's not generating! Five, no, wait. Four, okay, fine. Uh, three, he, he's two, well. Two. Wait, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. He's well mannered. <laughs> <laughs> and he likes. And he's well mannered and chill, so he accept it. He accept. He would accept. Hey, so it. you were about to just say, and he likes <laughs> jazz. And I'm gonna be like, excuse you. And he likes jazz. <laughs> so he accepts my my head pass with grace. Yes. Yay. Okay, I'm gonna edit. I'm gonna work on this personality real quick. <laughs> so... All right. So we're done at the gem shop. Oh, cave crawlers, what you doing next? Can we go to the academy? Alright, you guys... Does anybody else have any business left in the capital? Any shopping to do? Uh, um, I'm still walking. I'm just... Gonna buy me a cola if there's... Sorry. What was that, Hammy? Uh, is there like, uh, coffee beans or something? If you want to go to a coffee, you want to go get coffee? I want the coffee beans, so I could make my own coffee every time I wake up. Are you talking about in the game? Yes. Interesting. What? Okay, um... It's a good... You don't want to wake up with a good morning and a, and a black coffee? Coffee is gross. Well, <sighs> that's for you, my friend. That's for me, I need coffee. All right. Um, it doesn't take you long when you exit the um shop. Do do do. How much uh, health does the king have? <laughs> uh, that is a question you don't want answered anytime soon. Is can that I, a BBG? Wait, hold can on. Can I wait. check with insight? <laughs> can I can I try to check with insight? <laughs> You're not anywhere near close to a king right now, so no. But I'm like from memory. Hmm. Go ahead and do the check three times for me. You're taking the lowest of insight? the three. Insight? Of yep. insight? Okay. Yep, you're doing it three times. You're taking the lowest of the three. Okay, so I'm going to start with doing disadvantage. I'll roll that twice. And then one last time. Cool, I got five. <laughs> <laughs> that was an intimidation. Oh, yeah, you last... only rolled twice. You need to roll three times. Sorry. That was the wrong goddamn number. Alright, lowest with eleven. I I did a I did one that was uh with disadvantage, so there's two there. There's eleven, twelve, and then the last one. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah. Alright. Um so the lowest would be eleven, 11. plus so that, 
11 plus three. No, so the, the 12 is the lowest. I'm gonna say you don't know his exact health, but you can guess it's probably in excess of 100. Okay, cool. Thank you. Let's fight him. We can take him. No, 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 no. no. I, I have my own plans. <laughs> I have my own plans. Scare him to death? Um, yeah. Hammy, it doesn't take you long to find a, a vendor outside that has some fresh coffee for you to drink. Yeah. It's gonna it's gonna run you uh uh five copper pieces. Got it. Five Cooper. Oh god. Yep. Uh, just minus. I don't even for join the thieves the thieves guild website and so many charts. Does so this, useful. Does oh, this city yeah. have indoor like like bathrooms? Hmm? What? Do this like does this city actually have like bathrooms? Yes, most places have bathrooms, indoor bathrooms. I think I know where this is going. Like not like not like you shit into like a pan and then you like toss out your window kind of like bathroom. <laughs> but like no. What the hell? That's They've how they did it back sewers. in the day. Oh, good. Good. They actually do have sewer systems. Yes. Good. Unlike proper terra firma, this world has not gone through the Dark Ages. Oh, it never went through the Dark Ages. Nope. <gasps> A lot of issues happened in the Dark Ages for humanity. This place has not experienced something like that yet. yet? It's certainly possible it could eventually, but probably not in the Yeah. Campaign. Guys, should we start a Wait. pandemic? Hold on. If let's <laughs> say let's say if I were to get that gun and start raining terror. No, would, that, no. would that technically would I be strong enough to create a dark age with my gun? I'm just like. Well, if you create an my... army. I mean, if, um, have a drag. if you create an army, you could possibly yes, create. Yes, I want to create age. an army. Give them all guns. Yes, I'm gonna. We can, no, no, I'm really gonna. We can be the United you would have States. To find a way to... Grab a fucking twelve gauge in your dragon. That's what. You would have to find a way to asso to get, to manage to associate the atrocities. Your you and your army committed with the gun. If you I'm did, you could force the this planet into a dark age against tech because of their hatred of guns. Hmm. Uh, no, I'll blame it on. But then again, you'd have to remember we, if we do more than one campaign, and no. it will be also in this world. So if you did that, you would never get a gun again. Fuck. I mean, we could just. Take over the world. I like. Let's say, I mean, like, no, we can I'm, make I'm the world you. owned by no. the United States. No. <laughs> Good luck, Koalia. I Good hate luck. America, but I think it's funny. I want to make the next. Can we get like to an unknown continent? I don't and think make your make homeland would tolerate you trying that, Koalia. Oh yeah, I'm just. The Elven Kingdom would slap you down like the little fly you are. I can become more stronger and more powerful I'll give you, than I'll ever give you a gun. I'll give you a gun. Boom. You can try to become as powerful as you want, Qualia, but best solved. case scenario, you become a horse fly instead of a regular fly. I disagree. In the grand scheme of things? Yeah, I, I can do it. I can. Right, anyway, <laughs> focusing back on the campaign, folks. It's not, uh, not on the what ifs. Does anybody have anything else you want to do in this in the capital before you book passage to the academy? Oh, I got something. Hmm. Hmm. Can I go to the blacksmith again? <laughs> sure. Uh... It's gonna okay. be nighttime by the time we get to the pier. This is for important research, Corey. Are you sure about that? Yes. Good. Oh. Well, you already know where it is, so it only takes you like 10 minutes to get there. Sweet. Um. I, I want to talk to the blacksmith. <laughs> Alright. You walk up, and it's this young human girl manning in the front right now. Hey, what's up? Hello, sir. How can I help you? Okay. 
Can you educate me on what metals are e easy to mold? Or like malleable? <laughs> she kind of gets startled for a second. Looks at you. Make a persuasion check. Fuck! God damn it, it was on the 17. Oh well. <laughs> She just looks you up and down, sizing you, and it's just like, right. You're another one of those people who think you can create a master sword in, what, two days? What? No, no, no. I, I'm just curious. I don't want to make a sword. That shit's lame, you know? Like, I would really <laughs> easily thought. You just dissed their <laughs> whole line of work, dumbass. <laughs> oh, I mean, wait, hold on. No, wait, I think that's a... <laughs> Like, all of that was in canon. Qualia correcting him. All of that was in canon. She <laughs> heard it all. <laughs> no, oh, oh, I, mean, I, I mean, like anyone who tries to do it themselves without like pay, that's just so disrespectful against the blacksmithing community, uh, right? Uh. <laughs> blacksmithing the, the, community. The girl what? just, she's got her hand on her face, just making a face palm. And after a second, she just looks at you, Kali, and she's like, is he always like this? Wait, she can see me? Oh, Perhaps. right, you're, you're in ghost form. Shit. <laughs> okay. I just want to put my hand on the shoulder and go, yes. <laughs> she just uh, mutters under her breath. Is he, man, why are they... I'm gonna be our before. I could not understand that. Your mic was cutting in and out. So she mutters under her breath, "Man, why are they always like this?" Uh, can I, can yeah, I, I know, right? That? What a fucking idiot! Yeah, wait, what? Are you, I, are... I say that to her. I'm just gonna Talia, stare. Make an intimidation check for me. <laughs> I got a one. Oh my god! Oh no. Another person dead. Another one by death. Possibly. Yay. Should I roll damage? Should I roll two d twelve? I'm gonna save her again and get that knowledge. <laughs> Just you wait. <laughs> should, I, um, should, I... should I roll my d twelves for damage? Nope. <laughs> no. Hold on. Where'd he go? Amazing, top tier work. <laughs> no, I'll never know. Surprisingly, you do start her hole, and she kind of jumps back a little bit, and she bangs her head on the <laughs> back. Back there, there's a considerable amount of blood, but she's all right. Oh shit! Wait, you're. Oh, I think you're all right. You better be all right. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean for this to happen. You knocked her, and you knocked about sixty percent of her health off. Can I use healing ward on her? <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Go ahead and roll. Sweet. Five. Oh my god. Five. Five. Okay. <laughs> She's just got a cut on the back of her head now. It's oh. barely there. Oh. I'm sorry. Yeah. Uh, that's my ghost oh. friend. Yeah, sorry. I, I'm stupid. Just like she, him. She, she, she looks at you and just glares at you, rubbing the back of her head. She's just looking around, trying to spot Koala. You can't. You can't she walks. Swat her. To, she starts walking towards the back. She pokes her head past Kern, and you hear her holler, "Boss, got some special customers for you." Oh no! Way to go, Koala. <laughs> I just want some information. That's all I want. Wait, no. They're getting. They're they're, they're there to help us. They're getting nah, this. They're, they're, they're calling no, no. the boss. I don't think. Yeah. No. 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 They, they said good. that they're that they have special customers. They are getting the person who knows how to help us. Uh, I don't Just like, like have to help, to okay? Take, okay? Take it from someone with experience to fix up to help. So, after a moment, you see the curtain rustle a little bit, and out comes this five foot six tiefling oh. with beautiful blue skin that has slight patches of green every now and then. Hello! I wave I wanna at say, him. I want to say damn, damn nice skin, but... <laughs> um, um, please don't. I'm not going to say that. I'm just... 
Loki, roll a d20 for me. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Five. <laughs> Fuck. You didn't want to say it out loud. But you did. But, but you did. No. <laughs> Are you doing the thing that I do? She just looks at uh -huh. you and she flicks her hair back a little bit. The hair reaching about halfway down to her, her, her chest. Well, ah, what did I mean? Another admirer. I just I wanna I wanna put my hand on their shoulder uh, and say I'm so sorry uh, about okay. them. Okay. Yo, Corey, stop talking to them, please. We don't want we don't want anyone. Paulia, you got ignored. She <laughs> oh, she's oh, just looking straight oh. at Smokey. <laughs> Why? She's I'm not a... interested in talking to you. Oh my She's god! She's focused on Smokey. Oh, I did not. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's so okay. sad. Um, I was wondering, um, could you teach me, like, or tell me which metal or what metals are kind of easy to mold for, like, an artificer like me? She looks at you and is just like, oh. You want some one-on-one -on -one tutoring, huh? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. right. Oh man, I just really I don't know. know. <laughs> this is going. Can, can I? Can I just let them know I am not a bad ghost? I just say I'm not a bad ghost. <laughs> Who are you? You're gonna get ignored. Who I don't care. I want to let them know. Your group, or are you? No, to the team. One to, of them. No, to the person that we've been talking oh, to. To the tiefling? Yeah. Or to the shop To the Should've... tiefling. You're recording this, uh, right, please? Yes. I, all okay, I want to say is, hey, I'm not a bad ghost. I'm part of his group. As you go to touch her shoulder, she just looks straight at you. Quality is just like, I'll be with you in a second, honey. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> uh, really? Yes? Question, just... Just out of character. I need a recap for something. What happened at the castle? So, I don't know. yeah. For me, met... we stopped at the castle and then that was it. It yeah. was like probably a session or two sessions ago. Last session is when Last you met King. Oh, okay. What happened again? Because I, you, it's all I good. forgot. I'll recap for you, and also remember, Qualia posts all these episodes, so you're always welcome to cap that way as well. Plus a little recap. Yep, they actually make for a good podcast. Anyway, um, so what happened was that you went to go see the king, and when you arrived there, you spent some time, a couple hours, briefing him at what at the events of Newport and what happened there. Mm-hmm. During those events, you, while you're talking to him, you discover that this king actually, while he does have a queen to maintain his prodigy, he prefers his husband. Hmm? Wait, he, what? Say it again? He prefers his husband. He preferred the husband? Yes. He's Basically, damn, this boy. Basically, the guy is gay, but he needs know, to maintain know, appearances by being straight. Yup. And Qualia's natural 20 picked up on that. Yep. Nice. Yep. You also, during the cor course of talking to him, found a painting to your left as you were talking to him. And on Wait. That, isn't on that painting, he... Okay, sorry, sorry. I was gonna say, isn't he the guy that we should give the letter to? Or we already the... did. We did. You did. Oh, okay. okay. Yep. He did not react to that. He if didn't he react. Okay. So he's gonna be reading it in his own time. Oh no. Okay then. Well. Yep. Oh lord. Okay. Continue. Yep. And as you were doing that, again, this is because of Qualia's natural twenty that really carried. You look to your left, and you actually saw a painting of the very copper dragon you had met just a couple days before. And that's when you found out that that dragon is called Gondrus the Protective. And 
he is a frequent visitor of the castle. Oh, so, oh, so we, we did not attack. Technically, he attacked us. Then we tried to defend. We did a self-defense. Yeah, the king himself kind off. of acknowledged that as a laugh. Gondras is not well known for his social skills. Well, we accidentally angered him. Now we need more excuses whenever we see him again. <laughs> that if we ever gonna see him. Right? There's a good chance you will, as long as you're in the kingdom of Valina. And we are in, uh, what is the kingdom name? You are in the kingdom of Valina. Oh. Yep. There's, uh... there's several kingdoms in this in this world. This is just the one you started in. In fact, well, most of the you... characters here are not from Valina. Most of you hail from the nation of Zalgalia. Mm. I don't remember which one well, I am from. Uh, yeah. You hail Sorry, from the nation yeah. of Zalgalia. Uh -huh. Sorry, I, I just needed some recap real quick because yep. because no I problem. forgot. Sorry. It's continue. all good. Continue, please. Anyway, oh. yeah, it's all good, Hammy. Don't worry. I'm sure eventually everybody will need a recap. Heck, mm -hmm. the nice part about having a second DM is that eventually one day if something happens to me and I have to be gone for for a week, you have a second DM who can pick up for us. That would so eventually I'll need to be briefed. <laughs> anyway, um. Anyway, back to this horrible flirt session. Yes. Yeah. So that's when you discover that she's capable of seeing new qualia. Ah, uh, so it's my turn. She she looked at you oh. as you were going to talk to her, and she's just like, "I'll be with you in a second, sweetie." Rejected. Oh, wait, is she so? Is she like? She just rejected you. Wait, is no? She didn't say that you rejected me. So all she did no, was say like... that she will talk with me in a second. But can I read her like her mood of that? Like, can I read if that was supposed to be like a back, like a backhanded like compliment in a way? Like insight check. Either gonna be a fuck off or one second. Okay, fourteen. Whispers. Whisper, 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 whisper. I'm dying. Hello? Yeah, I was sending a whisper to uh, Soggy because of the insight check. Oh, sorry. Okay, then I'm just gonna back up a little bit and then just like lean against the wall if I can. Okay. Alrighty, and she turns her attention back to you, Smokey. And she responds with, You do realize my services are not. Or not what? You uh, asked if she could tutor you. Yeah. What'd you she say? responds with, um, you do realize my services aren't cheap, but she says in a very flirtatious oh, voice. My... <laughs> How would you like to be paid? Yeah, that happened. Um, can I just can I just walk out of here as soon as I hear that? <laughs> I just want to leave that building. <laughs> he has it covered. I'm dying. <laughs> then why are you doing this? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> You're not even a bard. Like it, How dare you? I don't want to, but I feel like it. I don't. Okay. Um. I mean, he has a guitar. I'm gonna <laughs> say, yeah. go ahead and roll. First, I would like you to make a Constitution check for me, Smokey. Oh no. 
Okay. Let's see how much the flirtation is get th getting through to you. Oh god. <laughs> it's getting through a lot. Uh... Okay. So because okay. of that, I would like you to make a persuasion check with disadvantage because she's getting to you. Fuck. God damn it, dude. And oh, this will no. determine the price. Oh. And it's not bad. It's not bad. It's oh. not bad. Okay, okay. Let's go. So, how quick of a study are you, handsome? <laughs> Give me a second. Give me... <laughs> this is, this is Why are you really... like this? Okay. Don't taste fun, go with one. I'm oh, breaking. Let me, just, let me just do some meditation. <laughs> Donkey's trying to get uh, his son a white, his son a mother. No! Hey, that's how you No, I'm mom. just trying to get- I just <laughs> want to know- I just want to know what metal would be good for a gun, that's all I want to know! That shopkeeper is- is making, uh, okay. is, is making <laughs> donkeys submissive and breedable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. I'm good now. What was the question? Moki, you're gonna, gonna go pack yourself, like man. <laughs> I mean, I'm- I'm an artificer, so I'm pretty fast. <laughs> I'm, I'm learning sorry. shit. Ah! Oh. <laughs> I had to say that. I'm sorry. I mean, you could say no. I can be. I can be fast. Yeah, that. I can be pretty fast. Ow. Oh, oh, my hand! I fell out my chair. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna. Yell that for. Oh, my hip. <laughs> Dear ah, Lord, me that time. Oh my god. Oh uh -oh. my god, my hip. Oh, oh. Okay. My hip. Um. She responds with, It's gonna take me a day or two to teach you what you want to know, love. It's gonna run you about a hundred gold. Um. We can oh. leave him there. Yeah, uh, how long would the trip to the middle take? To the academy? Yeah. Two days to get there. Don't know how long it will take you once you're there, and two yeah. days back. Hmm. So, reasonably, they'll be gone for about a week. Is there any way you can, like, have me teach me other stuff for a week? Or enough time to occupy a week-ish? <laughs> sure. I mean, you could be, um... <laughs> Do another stuff for a week. Oh yeah, actually. Yeah, yeah you could uh, be having fun for a week. No, shut up, shut up. A entire yeah. week oh. straight, non-stop. And no. this is how Danky builds a D and D family. Oh <laughs> uh, no, are you serious? Wait, hold on, what the D &D, fuck? No. <laughs> session. You have a son. You're about to get He's a wife. He's already got the son. He's working on the. Oh, there goes Who did we lose? We oh. lost. <laughs> Hey, I... welcome back, Nathan. <laughs> we have <been> comfortable. <laughs> I'm dying. I'm I'm dying so hard right now. I've never <laughs> died so much in my life. <laughs> so hard. Okay, sure. Billy, can I do some plans for the there week then? That, that yeah. I'll be sitting out. Okay, yep. sweet. Uh... Are you? And... Is your is your son gonna be staying with you, or is he going with a group to the academy? We can watch your son if you have fun. Stop, if you send the son with the group, you get to play as him for the for the week. I'll do that. Yeah, I'll I'll send my I'll send him with the. Yep. Yeah. I'll, do I'll... You keep in mind that means you're going to be at an extreme disadvantage because now you're playing get... as a level one rogue instead of a level yeah. three artificer. I'm a That's dungeon fair. master. Hey. Right. Kind of. I got this. <laughs> I mean, the bright side okay, is so, that, yeah. depending on what happens, you'll probably level up that character pretty quick. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. okay, I'm um, gonna kind of... I'll, I'll compile a... Compile a plan Just to... Smokey, go ahead and make a persuasion check for me. See how well your date with the blacksmith goes. Got 20! Fuck! Natural twenty. No. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Nine. That, that happens. <laughs> Mexi time begins. <laughs> no. 
What a bar! Um, what a fucking wow. bar! Yo, can, wow. I sell, can I multi-class to a bard by any chance? <laughs> 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 You're well on your way to. Oh my god, I'm gonna go ahead and hold on. Oh, don't make me roll anything else, please, Billy. <laughs> Are you gonna make him roll a sex roll? No, yes, no, please. no. It's very submissive <laughs> and beautiful. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> do you want me to make him do a bad roll? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm specifically referencing uh, a campaign so Smokey, line. go ahead and make a performance check for me. Sounds you have like a negative 20. <laughs> 20. <laughs> I'll let you decide in your own headcanon what that means, Smokey. No! Because we are not going there in this game. Perfect! Should I, I, we are doing tell... a cut to black. No, 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 no. <laughs> Should I it just cuts to black. It just cuts to black. Should I just DM you how it goes? <laughs> nope. Oh my, okay. If I'll, you want to. Uh, I'll be DMing you, or how the week goes, what he does, and then how. Yeah, okay. No. Do you want the group to know the name of the blacksmith, or do you want me to just DM it to you? DM it. Just DM me. <laughs> Go ahead and your. <laughs> D and D character sheet mark that as a lover in your relationship. Uh, a what? A lover. lover. <laughs> God, we're turning this guy's <laughs> life around. She has a oh son. God, about dude, to have a bro, wife. this is bullshit. Ah, this is <laughs> bullshit, bro. I just wanted. Okay. No, I, I just wanted to know gun information and metal. I. <laughs> okay. The one time I don't want the dice with me, they're like in a complete opposite way, dude. Oh my god. Hold on, I'm looking stuff up real quick. I feel like it would have been funny if uh, he was ace and would have just like had all of it go over his head. Like, she could be hardcore flirting. And then your character's like, yeah, that'd be great. I, nah. I'd love to learn. <laughs> And then, like, she starts getting looted, and then your character's like, Whoa, what the fuck? I thought we were trying to learn, man! Yeah, he's not ace. But he's certainly not straight. Yeah, I'll tell you that. Actually, that's, uh... Gross. Yeah, so... Straightness. Okay. <sighs> trying to figure out how much the co it's gonna cost. Uh, you guys to rent the boat. What if? Oh, thank God. Okay. Okay, we have two rogues. What if they steal the boat? A jack boat. Yes, I like you that. You can most certainly try. How about we don't? <laughs> well, actually, now that he said, you most certainly can try. No, we're not doing that. Yeah, we can have. Oh uh, we can have your son try it. Oh, Billy. Sh should I claim? The... <laughs> should I claim Lionel for now? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we could. Okay. Lionel's good at stealth. He's a level one rogue, dude. He's still good at stealth. Dude, I don't... he does. And he does enjoy a plus eight to stealth checks. I don't want to risk it. I really. No, okay, it would be great. You're so glad you just missed what the fuck just happened. No, no. no. Oh, it would oh, be. God. It would be great to be able to have a steal a boat rather than like you know pay oh. for it. You, you guys each got like 500 gold. You can't just pay for it. Like, you guys can easily afford a boat at this point. We could just steal it, though. That's a cool enchanted thing he's got. What the hell? Billy? Yeah? What happened to Taco? Taco's uh, secret uh, shopkeeper cat thingy. We talked you about. might encounter them someday. I want to. Okay. So, are you guys gonna try to steal a boat, or are you, you fucking cast Don't it? steal a boat, please. Steal Squeak. A, huh? Squeak, you're 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 steal a boat. At least steal a speedboat. Squeak, what somehow. did you say? 
why would we still... Oh, I think everyone has enough money to put a little bit into one. Yeah, but I don't want to pay money. <sighs> it's okay, you can't do anything about it if I put my hands in your pockets and take them. Okay, so it sounds like you guys just want to book passage? It's better if we do, yeah. <laughs> We're not about to fail a fucking All right. passage. What is going on? Okay. So you guys we'll make your way down to you guys make your way down to the docks. And Kriv, I'd like you to make a persuasion check, because you're gonna be the one talking to the cat. Oh, that's amazing. Nice die. Thanks. Just a straight ten. Not you, flashy. Looking. Yeah, Neither good nor bad. All right. Um. It's gonna run each person two silver pieces to make oh, passage. That's cheap. cheap. All right. You wanted to steal one. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, kid, kid, what do y'all pay for? Life? Our... Oh um, yeah, the boy's gonna have. I'll no I'll ones. I'll pay for um I'll pay for Lionel. I just paid for Lionel. Do you? I'll I'll say this. Does Smokey give his son any money for this journey? He gives him a hundred gold. I'll say right. that. Don't forget the other twenty that came from other spurious players. So put a hundred twenty in his account. Got don't, it. Don't He's rich. He's slowly <laughs> getting money. I'm proud of him. Uh, but yeah, no, okay, I, I much... paid. I already paid your thing. Oh. Okay. You already you already paid for travel for Lionel. Yeah. Okay. And everybody else is paying for their own? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I guess so, yeah. I am too. Okay. So, you guys put passage, and it's this fairly large ship. It's about four decks. It kind of reminds you of a ferry, like one of the large riverboat ferries. Wait, can I have given him a dagger too? Um, uh, Billy, repeat one more time. The boat itself, it kind of reminds you of a river ferry. You ever seen one of those? Nope. Alright, let me find a I rarely go out, let alone leave my country. Oops. Here, I'm going to go into images. I'm going to post it in D&D chat so we all know what I'm referring to. D&D chat. Uh, I'll put it in D&D all chat. Why? So, I don't know. So, there's a spectator with us. COVID is here. Yes, but they can still see D&D chat. Yeah, they can still see it, they're just not supposed to post in there. They can't. Oh. I mean, you could just give them a, you give them a roll, like, they can only see. They, cannot they just... already can. I don't have the ability to do that. Everyone can see in there. It's just that they can't type. Yeah, I don't know how Taco set it up in there. I do. I, I can, literally I just can, explained that. I can help out if you need. Yeah, oh. That's what it looks like. I got Adam. I said, don't worry. That's oh, no, fact, I know. No, just I know. to make things easier, that is the boat you're getting on. That is beautiful. The Twilight Sparkle. That's a nice boat, damn. The Twilight. Also, Billy. Yo, is Mickey Mouse there? I'm teacher and I'm ILITHC, and they know why they pony troll it down like me. I'm Twilight Licious. Oh, God. Billy. No. Billy. Yeah. Thank you. So, uh, yeah, can you review what I sent you? Is this or about the smut? It's about uh, it's about the week, yeah, I guess. I'll review it later. I Thank think. You. Oh, you should have said that with uh, COVID here. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> um. Everyone just went quiet. Yeah. I'm yep. Setting something up real quick. All right. Setting something up. That sounds yep. threatening. 
<laughs> Fur is going to crash. Can I change my name to Lionel? I guess since I'm playing. Oh. There we go. Do I still have this duck, not that dagger that. Hmm. Really? Okay. Also. Can I give, can I have given Lionel a dagger too? Sure. Okay. Wait, what the fuck? Why did you change your name to Lionel? That's the that's the boy. That wait, because, so you changed because... from... Huh? Wait. What Something happened. Happen? We're not gonna we're not gonna talk about it, but basically he's kinda occupied right now. That's all you need to know. You don't want to rest. Fucking damn it. But what is your... What? This boy has a sex drive. I... <laughs> well, no, the boy is the... Uh, is the street urchin that you guys adopted that Quale almost killed twice. Denki adopted. I'm still dying. Yes, I did. My dude did adopt him. It's Dinky, son. Yup. It's not the group that adopted him. It was Dinky. Thank you, okay. dirty whore. So... What the fuck? Dinky has a son and he's about to have a wife. Get on board. Mind you, the two silver per pot per person, that was for the passage itself. There is a cafe on board, so you will still be paying for your own food. Yeah. I'll, I'll have a coffee. Yep. Also, I'm gonna rule that Danky, that Smokey's character is taking care of the cart, so you guys don't have to worry about that. Um. Parker's what's your mind? Yeah, I won't have cards anymore. Okay, so. Wait, what about my body? Get... Yeah, that's a good question. What are you doing with Qualia's body? There's. You really should bring it along. Uh, isn't it? Wait. It's very necessary to bring it. Yep. That's why I said last session that we should have made a box for her body to be in. Can we just, like, explain to the guards the situation? Won't they understand? I mean, yes, we could. But... Um, go ahead and make a persuasion check with advantage. I am giving you extra help. Don't worry. You got this. Hey, 20. Again. Yep. Yep. The captain sighs and just like more magical bullshit and lets you on board with Qualia's body, but it does it they are gonna charge not only the two silver for Qualia's passage, but an extra silver for what you're doing. Oh wait, I did that with Smokey. Oh ooh. It's all right. Uh, you said it Smokey is Because Smokey would still be at the docks since you haven't left yet. Oh, okay. So you guys get on board. Qualia has been set up in one of your rooms. Because some... there's not a lot of people on board, so you each get your own individual room. Can I give my son a, a hug goodbye? <laughs> yep. <laughs> you do. Okay. I waved him off. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. And you guys cast off. Are you guys just gonna chill in the boat? You gonna walk the perimeter, take a look around? What you doing? For these two days? Mm -hmm. You got two days to kill. Are you gonna walk the deck? Or are you gonna... Can I... Wait, kill? Two days to kill. Can you I... Got time. Um, question. I'm sorry. What's up? Can I, I practice, uh... My intimidation skills? Can I am 50% done in training for intimidation? Can I try to practice that? What's your current plus to your intimidation? Uh, plus two. Plus two. Is there anybody in the campaign who has plus three or better? Wait, intimidation? Uh, yeah, what? in intimidation. I got plus uh, No, I have plus two. No, Wait, plus one. Okay, I've just uh, said plus, plus four, right? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Crave, can 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 uh can I can you finish my training 
in, in, Kriv in can help you. It's going to require some rolls, and Kriv can charge you if she wants. <laughs> 2,000 gold, take it or leave it. <laughs> no, I won't be that mean. I won't be that mean. That? You said that. <laughs> what do you, what do you uh, mean? 999 gold. <laughs> I, like I won't be you that make, mean. Uh, you you can make up mean. your own price that if you want to, Kriv. My personal recommendation would be to go with 20 silver per day. Or sorry, 20 gold per day. Right, yeah. I was thinking of five gold because I'm like so nice, but <laughs> hey, it's your call if you want to do that. You can even make it five silver if you wanted to. It's five gold. You if you want to charge, you can. I'm charging her five gold. Okay. Can um, I Cole, barter? You char- no. <laughs> can I? I would bar- like. I would like Qualia to make a um, persuasion check. Kriv, make a constitution check. Oh, I made a saving throw. Oh, four. That's fine. We'll use the saving throw. Ooh. Uh. Ooh. Yeah. Ow. Lower it to one gold. One gold a day. Yeah, you find that completely fair. Like, I'm not going to try to, like, completely make it, like, in the silver range, but, like... I can't believe you. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Uh, Why would you do this? Rinse and repeat one more time, both of you. Gold a oh. day, and it's going to be two days, so oh, what if I just spend 10 gold? But, uh... My God. That's a detail. It's going to cost you the five gold for the second day, Paul, yeah. <laughs> Well, let's try the first day. Wait, can we try the learning on the first day, though, first? It Considering takes... it usually takes a week to do a full thing, I doubt you're going to be able to complete it in two days. Can I still try to roll, though? Okay. Go ahead and make a... Um, just roll a straight d20. I want to see if I can do it in one. Only a natural 20. Oh! Will help you here. <laughs> it was out of my second! Oh. Oh! And it actually takes you three days. <laughs> Go ahead and add another 5% to your completion. I hate this. <laughs> Go ahead another. Go ahead and roll another 20. Bruh. <laughs> Actually, before you add the 5%, um, uh, Kriv, make two performance checks for me. Mm hmm. Damn. 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 Jesus. <laughs> okay, um, go ahead and add a total. So, you're up, you said you started at 30%, right? No, I was at 50. 50? I was 50% done. Okay, go ahead and I'm gonna say you're at uh, 85% now. I knew you were gonna say 85. I'm okay, so, so a good teacher. So that's six gold in total? Yes. Okay. Yep. You, ha- you were having trouble learning it, but Crib's been has taught people before and Thanks to her skills as a teacher, you're able to keep up. I think even his? Because they're playing a guy. Mm-hmm. Wait, what? Kriv is playing... <laughs> the character of Kriv is a guy. Shit, my bad. <laughs> Sorry. Ah. DMs are human, too. Yeah, I know. <laughs> anyway, um... Anybody else have something they want to do during these two days? Can I explore the boat? Okay. Make an investigation check. I wanna as well okay. just go yes. the boat as well and see what is the other rooms other than the cafeteria. I really need to go oh my god, yeah, I did an investigation check, I forget about it. Got it. Investigation it is. Oh <laughs> I didn't hey, explore anything, forget it. <laughs> <laughs> I got a an, a natural 21. Hey, um, can I 
Can I drag Squeak with me? Yep. Yeah, come here. Who are you with me, Squeaky? <laughs> We're gonna check it. We're gonna check the place together. Yep. Squeaky. Squeaky. You That's check you. most of it. it mm -hmm. Most of it's what you expect. You do find a door on the bottom deck that leads below water that is locked. Though that that in of itself is not surprising. It's probably crew area. Menacing. You do, however, on the second floor find another locked door where you really do not expect a locked door. Hmm. Uh... Especially since, considering you can actually go up to the uh, fourth deck and actually be in the wheelhouse with the crew as they're navigating. Oh. They don't even lock that door, yet this door is locked. Sus. Very sus. V very sus, really. Mm -hmm. Wait, is I guess you say one of the crewmates. Um, let me check my inventory real quick. <laughs> can I detect this as well? Can I ask what detect magic on it? If yeah, to see if there's a uh, what is okay. the word? Go ahead and mark off the uh, luck pick uh, spell slot. Yeah, and unfortunately, you do not detect any magic. Hey, that's at least good to know. It's a good idea. And to lock pick it. You want to attempt to lock wait. pick it? Do it. Wait, wait. Do yes. I need certain items for it, though, right? What was that? Do I need certain items for it for lock picking, or do you have a lock pick set? Don't think so. Let it me should see. Be counted as under like thieves' tools or something like that, if I recall correctly. Oh, I do have thieves' tools. Yep. Then Click you have a lock pick set. So it's like an automatic thing, even if it doesn't appear in my inventory. I think so. Let me double check. I'm in your inventory now too. Well, so I'm just that blind. If you click on it, it should give you more information. Yeah. A small file, a set of lock picks, a small metal oh, mount okay. on a metal handle, a set of narrow blade scissors, a pair of pliers. Okay, perfect. Then yeah, I want to try to lock pick it. Uh... What role would that be? Um. That's a good question. <laughs> Is there a thing? Uh, okay, it counts as a dexterity check, but you get to add your uh, proficiency modifier. Oh, uh, dexterity check. Proficiency so you modifier. would click dexterity and then remember to manually add your plus two afterwards. Uh, wait. So click. So it will be plus six in total then? Yes, plus six total. Okay, let's so do this. Dexterity. Oh my god, six okay. Plus six, so 12. That will be 12. Oh, you're joking. <laughs> you're not able to pick it. Shit. Did anyone... You can try oh. again, but you get the feeling if you can't hang around much longer, you risk detection if you try again. Ah, uh, should I... We're gonna be here two days, right? Yep. And this is the first day. Yep. Okay, I'll wait to either nighttime or tomorrow then. Okay. So yeah, no, I'll just let's just move. Lionel, what are you doing? Um, 
I don't really know how to play as Lionel, but uh, I don't know this person. You've been a street but... urchin for most of your life. After okay. meeting this ragtag group of people, they introduced you to a man of wealth and knowledge that you never thought possible. Now you're on this adventure on one of those boats you've seen passing through the city for the first time. Okay, thank you. You're kind of um, awestruck right now. I would like to be admiring the view of the... Okay. Make a... Um, what's it called? What's it called? What's it called? Perception check for me. Why don't you get on that one? Oh my <laughs> god, I almost got on that 20. Bro, this is some bullshit. <laughs> it's a very magnificent view. The lake is pretty clear, and while it's not especially big, you can already see the academy from here. Though it is far enough that it just takes a, just shy of two days. You can also see the mountain peaks to the um, to the east. Yai Caster's mountain range. And you can see the storm clouds starting to gather overhead of the mountain. Damn, holy It's kind shit. of ominous, but it's so far away it doesn't feel important right now. I know that town. Okay. Just so that's around. what you're doing. Yeah. Um, Qualia, what are you doing? Or what you're doing the training with Kriv. Yeah, I'm having my training so arc. That's that's everybody. For the first day. Right? Night strikes. Um, hold on, gotta do something real quick. Okay. So it's nighttime. Who's doing what? Danny, what is your what is your character been up to tonight? I was gonna ask, can I bring Lionel with me? Yeah. Dan oh, of Danny, course, if there? Danny's fine with that. But I'm sorry, if Danny's not fine with that, yeah. Hammy. Hammy. Um, oh. I think he's having tech issues. Yeah, probably. Oh, so thank you. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Hey, welcome back. Okay. Hello? So, Hello. I'm sorry, my mic is garbage today. You, it's all good. Are you joining uh, Lionel and Squeak on their little uh, adventure with the door? Uh, I guess so, yeah. I mean... Yeah, yeah, let's go. Okay. I was I was gonna say I'm gonna go to the cafeteria, but no, right. you know what? Uh, Fuck food. Let's go. Alright, Qualia and Kriv, what are your characters up to? Are we not still training? Mm -hmm. It's nighttime. You're not gonna be training during the night. Why not? I don't need sleep. I want to come with. <laughs> you know me. <laughs> you know what? Fuck you it. Can, I'll, you I'll can go try with them. training. You can try training at night, but you. I... Wait. Can I try training by myself at night? No, you need a teacher at this point. <laughs> you're too proficient to try and learn on your own. Basically, you're too dumb. No, uh, not too dumb. You're too advanced. Too advanced? Oh, damn. Uh, fine. I'll go with it's the um, ragtag crew. Four well, eyes, the butter. Your, your character spent the morning, the afternoon training, so... Unless one of the ragtag come let you know what they're up to, you you're not aware. Can I try to search for them? Make an investigation check to see where they where they were as a means set. Where they are. Eighteen. Yep. <laughs> you notice you notice them kind of grouping together, pulling Lionel in. It looks like they're up to something, but you can't tell what from here. Uh, I'm just gonna slowly approach and just be quiet and then just like pretend like I've been part of the group the entire time. Um, Squeak, Lionel, and Danny make. Uh, um, Should I roll stealth? Yeah. Go ahead and roll stealth. Everybody else, go ahead and roll perception check. A what now? Perception. 
All right, Thank I you. have an 11 for Are skill. you serious? That's a 17. <laughs> I have plus three on perception. Let's see. I got a 12. Okay, so, and Quali rolled 11, so, so only Lionel. So literally only Lionel does it. Yep. Squeak. But I rolled And Danny, now. you're in the middle of plotting, thinking about what you're going to do in various situations about the door. When you notice Qualia in her ghostly form, trying to sneakily join your group like you, she's been there the entire time. What do you do? Uh, you know what? I have an idea. As I said, uh, I, I'm talking as Danny. You know what? I have an idea. Uh, I just not. To, I just. Holy shit! She can go oh, through the door. Cororia. Can I go through a door? Yes, I was gonna ask you that, Cororia. Can you actually can enter I go the try door? Try to go through the door. I would okay. like to try. Yes. Go for it. Go for it. I was gonna ask you that as a character. Right. But, yeah. So the four of oh. you going up to the locked door? I know I am. I guess. Remember, it's it's. Okay, I didn't sense here. any detect magic. I didn't detect okay. any magic. So I think you're good. Yeah, you go up to the door, and it's. Go ahead and make a. Um. I'm gonna say make a dexterity check for me, Qualia. Please get us all, no, please. 19. Oh yeah. my god, yes. That's some good shit. Yes. <laughs> you almost, it takes a little bit of effort, but you almost effortly, effortlessly face through the door. Damn, nice. Uh, what, uh, can I, can I check around what's in here? Can I just try to look first before trying to touch anything? Well, I can't really touch anything. Or can I? Oh. Ah, whispers. Whispers, whispers. Whispers. Whispers? Wait, what? Uh, should what I, do you do, should, Qualia? Should, should I say out loud? That's a, that, actually, no, I was gonna say you can't because your, your character is out of touch with the group right now. No, I mean, should, like, should I say like out loud in this, in the call? Or should I type my, my Yeah, reply? I'm going to say, keep typing. Okay. Sorry, folks. All good. All good. That was this? interesting. I'm going to be honest. I kind of zoned out because I kept getting ghost pinged on another server, so I had to deal with that. Just send them pictures on, like, another server. Basically, basically, then we're trying to figure out what the hell is behind the door. Okay. And instead of uh, having a Lionel and me luck pick, we have Cora going <laughs> actually <laughs> to the room. <laughs> what the fuck happened? <laughs> what? Wait, 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 let me, let me, let me ask. Um... Wait, wait. Huh? What's going on? Uh, natural ones are a bitch. <laughs> Where? I'm not. Wait, did you. I had to roll it privately. It oh, okay. I mean, that would have been funny. Okay, uh, then I want to, like, try to just phase my head through and try to go talk to the other bitches. Okay. You have to face your arm as well so you can touch us. Oh no, I just want to face only through my head through just so I can talk. Cause I can I I'm connected to you guys, remember? Alright. Oh yeah. I have the tele touch on telephone power. Yep. Uh I face It my... lets you guys see and t hear her without physical contact. Uh I just lean my head through and I go. Um I, there is someone in in here? If I think they might be dead. I can't tell. I don't know if there's a pulse. Did, did you think that someone killed someone and locked them in here? Wait, there's somebody. Oh, okay. There's a body I... on the ground. Oh, man. I didn't kill uh, this okay. this time, okay? Can I try to kick you okay. No, 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 no. We both are rugs, bro. No, 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 wait. Okay. Um, can I try to lock First, and then have and then Danky have Lionel try if I fail. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. 
That okay. Just be careful. So it's dexterity them... again, right? I yeah, it's dexterity. I want to let them know to not let the like. The Are you kidding drop. me? Don't forget, what? you add the extra plus two from your proficiency. Yeah, yeah it's a fourteen. A plus, it's a fourteen. Is that good enough then? It's not. It's a DC fifteen. Okay, okay, then we need. Okay, then Lionel needs to do this now. You got this. Lionel, you okay, got can this. I use silence? Uh, oh. There we go. That'll do. That's my boy. Together, Squeak and Lionel working together, because Squeak, you were having trouble doing it on your own. But then Lionel shows yeah. up with his own lockpick set, and he's holding the brace for you so you can focus on getting the pins. And together, the two of you pretty much effortlessly get the lock off. I give him a high five. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I, I, I just want to like, uh, when, when the door opens up, I want to point to the body. Okay. Yeah. You guys open the door, and there on the ground, about two feet in, um, is, there's just a body I'm, laying on the floor. I want to. We should probably close the door behind us, just so now no one notices. Mm. There's a try. I run through the body and check for a pulse. Don't Make run! A survival check. Can I investigate uh... them? See. How did they die, or like survival? Like step wounds. Give me um, can I make a thirteen? Yeah, sweet. You, you assume yeah. that it must have been tougher for Qualia because of her ghostly state, but the second you touch their neck, it's cold. You're not even trying oh, to get a pulse at this point. Can I make a um, constitution check to so see someone... how I handle this? Okay, I want to investigate them as well. If there's like oh a my god, I almost had a four. Holy shit. Yeah, Lionel, this is not the first time you've seen a dead body. Remember the the house you grew up in? Actually, yeah. can I investigate to like see if they have like any identification on them? Go ahead, but you're, I'm going to rule you get disadvantage because you're ghostly state. Disadvantage investigation. Alright, I got this, guys. Don't worry. Oh, you were on a 16, you little bitch! <laughs> it was on a 16! And it was just It's staying. actually... The other roll was a 17, actually. Yeah, no, it was a 7. The 3 was on 16 for a long time, and then it moved at the last second <laughs> over onto the 3. And I was like, you little <laughs> bitch! <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Uh, You're still getting used to your ghostly state and the limitations therein. You're not able to find anything in there. Can any of you guys find any identification on him? I I want to at least That's figure out. Why I want to investigate? I've been saying this like. Yeah, go oh. ahead. Roll with advantage, Hanny, because Quali is helping you. Thank you. Uh, I got a twenty unnatural. Ooh. Nice. Yes, I want to as well check if there's like any stab wounds, like where is located. If there is a stab wounds. Or how did the person die? That will be a medical check later. Can I look okay, for anyone can I ask do that? Yeah, well, hold on Wait. a second. Oh, Hammy. So, you search the body, and um, you're able to find, actually, this person's pretty well off. There's 15 gold, 8 silver, and 2 copper. I don't hmm. take it, I just keep it. You um, did their count pocket. as... You, you find us you find a small golden dagger lodged on their back. It's not sheathed though. It, it it's still sheathed. So they never had a chance to use it. Oh yeah, what has happened to my uh, to the uh, to that golden dagger that I got from a box? Is it still with me? Yep. Okay. It should still uh... be it should be in the inventory you put in. I forgot to put it in my inventory. And it's all good. Uh, you can add it when you're ready. Uh, and you find okay. a paper. That... A paper. And I read yep. it. Yep. I want to read that. It's what a letter. It? It's a letter? Yep. So you open the letter? Yes, I open the letter. Dear and... Asash. A-S-H-E-S-H. Asash. -E -S okay. I miss you, brother. The Academy, it's... It was fun when I first got here. But lately, they've been getting more strict. 
and the professors have been asking me strange questions. Oh, God. Questions I'm not sure how to answer. Wish you were here to guide me. With love, Terabeth. <laughs> Y'all better thank me for wanting to open that door since the moment he said that it was locked. Okay. Because we just got information from the fucking academy. Um, okay, can I? I, I want to give that to. to I want to show this to everyone, if that's okay. I want to okay. show that, that same letter to everyone. I, th I have a small feeling about about this. Uh, uh, what is it called? The roll boat? Boat? Whatever it's called. I feel like it's being hijacked. Because why is there three dead bodies and there is like no law? There's only one. Law. There's only one dead body. One dead body in there. Why no one has reported it? The Can I as well locked. check since? Yeah, I know it's the door locked, but even the captain can't go and check in there. But Wait, nobody the even tried checking. No Probably one. I'm no good. one bothered. Um. I just want to make sure you did count us as closing the door, correct? Yes. Okay, good. It is closed door, some, but yeah. Can I check? Can I see <clears throat> the med medicine check? Can I check uh, this dead body has been there for like how many days? Hey, oh, how many you hours? You go to begin checking the body, and as yeah. For its for what killed it, and as you do, I'd like everybody to make a dexterity saving throw for me. Including me? Yeah, including you. Dexterity saving throw. Okay. Oh, saving throw. Wait, did you say saving throw? Oh shit! I am gonna get hit. Nineteen. Dexterity saving throw. Yep. Okay, seventeen. I got four. I failed so hard. <laughs> it's alright. I failed. Uh, no, it's not. Anyway. As you go to reach, there is a... The boat lurches hard like it's been hit by something. Danny, you fall over from the impact. Okay. Can I look at the this, this room, it's on the starboard side, so it's on the right side of the boat. You all got knocked towards the port, so the left side of the boat. And it's, there's still a little bit of light out. It's still just past dusk. And all of you instinctually look out the window and you see a giant tentacle. Oh, oh my God. God. No, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> giant Dang. tentacle. So we've been attacked by an octopus. Big giant octopus. I like how no green one acknowledges my shit. <laughs> what are you guys gonna do? Um, can I ignore it and just try to investigate the rest of you the room? Because I can't do jack shit against Hold on. it. Does do we have to? Can you ignore it or anything? Like any defense? Or... Is there like yeah? Know, is there right? any defense system? Anything like? Can I investigate oh. and see what we can know, or if I can know? Can I check if there's like a? Wait, is this like a storage room? Uh, no, where it's we a, are? it's a private room. It's a private room. Oh my god! Can, can I, I check? Can I run out and alert the guards? No, <laughs> be careful. Wait, a few. Okay. Uh, alert the guards about what? They're probably a giant fucking tentacle. What else? I think they, they would have noticed. noticed. They probably already know, but. I... Okay. Just want to be sure. You might go so back to where you oh, were. So Lionel has run out the room. What are the What are the rest of you doing? I want to continue trying to investigate the rest of this room. I want to see if there's anything in here. Okay. Squeak, what are you doing? Um. Uh, well, I would love to go out and check the fight. I think I'm gonna help out Cora. Okay, Tammy, what are you doing? Um. Uh... I guess uh, help uh, 
Leonang. Oh, great. Run, you run out the door the with Lionel. Yeah. Yes. I'm gonna oh, look. Because the druid with me. We got this now. Right. Just tell Yay. Him. Fuck off, please. About 30 seconds after Lionel and uh, Danny uh, Lee. Yeah. All, so, um, all five of you, so you two as you're running on the deck, the rest of you as you're in the room, hear a booming magical voice that you recognize as the captain. All hands, if you can fight, get to the deck. Passengers, that means you too. You don't want to those... die, get moving. I'll, I'll tell everyone else, hey, you guys Wait. go do that. I'll try to check out this room. Just be sure to Wait, close so the door on your way out. Maybe um, lock it, it again. Light? We lock the Actually, door. Actually, can I can I go help Corey? Yes, it's I probably am in no. You already ready. ran out the door, Lionel. You can't. You uh, just ran out back. the door. You can't. Huh? <laughs> you can't just go then come back then. <laughs> I can't. God damn it. Dude, okay. Just... So, um, Squeak, what are you doing? I think I'll run out of Lionel's sound. <laughs> All right, so one, two, three. Kriv, what are you doing? Her sister's just... on an angry phone. Yeah, yeah, she is. She's so scared. Um, just I would just follow everyone. All right, so you're following out. You're you're mm -hmm. leaving your room and you're going to investigate the the disturbance. All right. Um, I would like everybody but Qualia to make an um initiation roll. Yeah, okay. Fourteen. Wait. Uh, it was going to. I initiative. Eighteen. Yep, initiative. Also, so we're opening uh, the inspire. What is it called? Tailspire. No. Not today. Not there. Uh, hey, look, I'm really. I got a twenty. Nice. Is it? So Danny rolled a total of 20 for initiative? Uh, total, yes. Yeah, not. Qualia is not, so she gets zero. Squeak? 14. 14. Kriv? Kriv got a 7, and she's Six. AFK? No, she, okay. her sister's on a really angry call, so she's trying not to be too loud. Gotcha. Oh, Lionel? Uh, 18. 18? What's weird is when I scroll down to Lionel, I don't know why, but the system had you marked as a negative one for initiative. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> you yes. should count that. You should count that. Give me, like, super... Literally the last of everyone, <laughs> even before the captain. No, like, I, just, I wait until the end of time, and then I take... Me. I need a practice month with a lot of money for my strength. So you guys get to the deck. The, the open deck of the ship. Oh. And there you see that the... Um, that the... Um, God, why you do this to me now, D&D &D Beyond? Okay, give me a second, folks. D&D &D Beyond's not being happy with me. Okay, there we go. I've, I've fixed the issue. The old enemy spider. Um, here. Uh, Chili? Yeah? Here, I sent you something. Just check on it. You don't have to open, open it. Just at least look at the pictures. Hmm. Nice. I might use that later. Yay. Okay. Let's go. So, you guys go out to the deck and you see that there is indeed a giant octopus attacking the ship. And it's using three of its... Um... Yes. Actually, sorry. So, you guys go up to the deck of the ship. And you see it's not one giant octopus that's attacking the ship. It's Three. Huh? It's already a giant octopus. Why is there three of them? 
Can I talk to Danny real quick? Yep. What's up? What's cracking? <laughs> Danny, you're a druid, right? Can't you, like, talk to them or something? Tell them to fuck off. Like, oi, fuck off, mate. Well, yeah. <laughs> you're a druid. You, you know nature shit, right? Please tell me you know nature shit. I don't like squids. You really like squids? I don't. I don't. I don't. How do you want me to help? I if I know talk how to, to talk, talk to them. Them. What, you're, a you're a druid. Can't you, like... You do nature shit. I don't know, right? Yeah, I may be a doing, fucking. Right? Oh my lord! I oh my creation creator. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know how can I help you with that. I cannot. Wait, well, no, I can. I can talk draconic, elvish, monitor, but celestial. I cannot. Deep sea is not my proficiency, my friend. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Only thing we could do is fucking kill them. That at, if this, can. at this point, you look down, and the three giant octopus have pretty much decimated the ship's crew complement. They're all still alive, but they're just not capable of helping you anymore. Wait, the crew is down? The crew is down. Okay, can I what get am I at the first fucking, uh, at the nearest uh, right, octopus? So we're beginning combat. Yes. Danny, you're up first. Yes, like I said, uh... Level two uh, guide uh, guiding bolt. Right. So uh, there's three of them: one to the left, one in the center, and one to the. Never right. mind. I'm not gonna be able to. Can I use my inspiration? Yep. Uh, Go what ahead can... and roll that again with advantage. Got it. What advantage it is? So advantage and just disable the inspiration. So that's it. Fine. And I got uh, 19. Okay, 22 to hit total. Go ahead and roll for damage. Got it. And are you hitting the left, the center, or the right one? Uh, the right one. Oh, Jesus, okay. I got 22. Damn. Yes. That's the first Guiding Bolt. That's the level 2 Guiding Bolt. Yep. So, mm. do you guys see a concentration of this bl um, light blue light just shoot out of Hanny's hand? And it strikes the octopus on, um, right at the root of one of its tentacles, sheathing the entire tentacle clean off. Jesus Christ. Nice. nice. Okay. Do you have anything you, want you to do with your bonus action? Uh, I don't think I can use uh, any spells, huh? Okay. I wanted. To... Can I? Do you have anything that can be done with your bonus action? It shows you I... in the action chart. I know, uh, the only thing I have is my spiritual weapon, but the problem but you is... you have to bring that out I... first. What's up? You have to bring your spiritual weapon out first. Can I? You would, it, That would be an action. Oh, fuck. Um, it's all good, you still get great this turn. Uh, what is this ritual spells? I have the detect magic. Is it just like... Those there? are out of combat spells. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, bonus attack. There's the spiritual weapon and there's the weapon. But I don't think there's the shine of divinity, turn and dead, unarmed strike. No, no, nothing. Uh, I just can I? Uh, I you have still have your third... movement. The octopuses are about thirty feet in front of you. What level am I on this boat? The second level, third level. Third level. Uh, is it just three levels? There's four levels. Okay, can I go to plus the fourth the, one? Plus the under deck. No, can I go to the fourth? I want to be like, I want to have a clear view. I don't okay. want... Yes. You scramble do... up to the fourth deck, it's going to consume your entire movement. Yes, that would be nice. Okay. You have a slightly clearer position of the battlefield, but not much. Yes. The biggest That's thing okay. is now that you have relative safety from their melee attacks. Yes. Good thing I have my lightning okay. bolt. Lionel, it's your turn. Quick question. Hmm. Smokey infused his dagger with returning weapon. Does that count still? It's infused to Smokey. It's to ah, Smokey, okay. not to yeah. you. Wait, okay. you're you're Smokey's son, Lionel. Yeah. You, Wait, are you his like lost? Son or something? No, adopted. Adopted. 
adopted. Wait, is it that the warlock kid or whatever? His, the one no, who tried to steal he's a street urchin that the group encountered just a couple of days ago. Yeah, but, oh, okay, okay. Just I need three couples. Who's this boy? Yeah, he's the boy that Qualia almost killed twice. <laughs> Um, yes, that is the one who almost died by the hand of the Cororia. Okay. He died once by Qualia, and Qualia almost God. accidentally killed him a second time. <laughs> Good, make a third. <laughs> no. <laughs> you see, Aaron was the problem. Lionel's a character Dinky doesn't want to have killed. And he's and about he's like, to get into the point. first one. <laughs> so, Lionel, what are you doing? Uh... Continue. I want to attack, but but I'm fucking low as hell on HP. Holy shit! I don't have and much. What's your AC? Uh, my AC is fourteen. So I fourteen. That's not bad. I don't want to risk it. Okay. I, know, I mean, do you have any ranged options? It, I don't have any ranged options other than my dagger, which I don't want to lose either. That's why I asked if it was still infused. Okay. Uh, so. <gasps> Are there any spears I can improvise? Make like, a perception check you know? to see if you notice any weapons nearby. Twelve. You notice a fa a, a fallen crew member about five feet in front of you. They're an archer, and they so there's a bow and about ten arrows there. Could I grab that and then run up to her? Danny is. Yeah. Uh, what's your movement speed? Thirty. I guess it could. You're gonna be on the ladder at the end of your movement, so you wouldn't be able to use your, uh, bow if you did. Okay. Um, You're gonna have to use your bow before you get on the ladder. No, I just want to pick it up and then go. Yeah. Up there. I don't want to. You don't want to okay. fire. I don't want to fire. That's all I. I just. Want, I just want the bow. Do you want to do anything with your bonus action? I can't. You're a rogue. Remember, you can use your bonus action to do stealth. If you are hidden from your enemies as a rogue, you get sneak attack damage. I forgot. When you attack. Yes, I want to stealth my. I want... Stealth check. I want to hide. Yeah. <laughs> you are hidden. <laughs> Twenty-two. Let's go. Three. That plus eight is going to come in handy. Okay. Yeah. Oh my God. Jesus Christ. Yep. Wait. So this is me. Does this mean I'm safe from melee attacks now, kind of? Yeah. They don't know you're there, so they can't hurt you. Sweet. Let's go. Okay. I get one additional creature for each. That's what I'm doing then. I forget. Okay. I don't. Yeah. I'm good. So the octopus in the middle is going to rush at you, Kriv. And is going to use their melee attack. By the way, you can talk in D&D &D chat if you don't want to use voice. It's fine. Can you hear me, though? Okay, cool. Just want to make sure you can hear me. Okay. 13 to hit. Does that hit? Nice. Okay, so that's the end for that one. Squeak, it's your turn. I have a question that I wanted to make previously. Uh, have any of the octopi done any noise at all? Kind of a slurping sound, but nothing really of note. Okay, yeah, I'm not going to need that. Okay. Make <laughs> <laughs> so to attack with my short bow. Okay, on the left, the center, or the right one? Uh, which one was going after Krivigam? The one in the center. Then that one. Okay. Okay. Uh, are you kidding me? That, oh, wait. Okay, that's good. Uh, 15. Okay, that hit. Perfect. Okay. Please. Hey, ten. Nice. <laughs> okay. Uh, 
your arrow hits the hits the giant octopus pretty similar to how uh hot uh hammy or danny's uh guiding bolt hit um the octopus to the right it doesn't cleave the octopus's tentacle straight off but it's 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 barely on I want to do my bonus action of um the two weapon fighting. I would need another for both for doing it, or can I use the same one? No, you because it's a two weapon. It's a two handed weapon. Okay, so that means that the only thing I could do is hide for now. Okay, make a stealth check for me. I don't know what the fell on. Okay, that's a 22. Ooh, nice. Wait, that's an identical roll to... Is it? You rolled identical to Lionel. <laughs> <laughs> Literally a 14 and you both get a plus 8 to your stealth. <laughs> Man, you guys are in concert today. But yeah, you are hidden. All right. So that's the end for Squeaks. Are you going to move, though? Yeah, whatever I have to hit, I guess, behind a box if there's any, that's, that will be it. What? You asked if it was going to move, right? Yeah. I didn't hear where you wanted to move to. Oh, if there was any box or anything that I could perfectly hide on with the 22, then yeah. There's a small box to your left you can dart over there to try to hide with. Good enough for now. Alright. Okay. The octopus to uh, the left is going to charge. It can only see Kriv. Kriv is the only one visible now. So, I'm sorry, Kriv. But you're you're, you're going to be at the tank for the group now. Good thing you put armor. <laughs> oh yeah. So <laughs> they're going to roll to hit sixteen. Holy. Okay. Um. That's just hit. Then you take thirteen points of damage, oh, and I I'd like that. you to make a dexterity saving throw for me. What are you down? Uh, no, I got an advantage on dexterity. So I can see. So yeah, so you would get advantage then. Got a 15. Oh, buddy. Oh, this doesn't sound good. The DC is 16. Oh, you are restrained. So your speed is now zero, and you don't benefit from any bonuses, bonus to your speed. You now... Any creature that goes to attack you now gets advantage, and your attack rolls now get disadvantage. And you will you now receive disadvantage on your dexterity saving throws, which means it's now just a straight roll when you do it from now on. So what happens in game is that the tentacle comes whipping out at you. You try to go to dodge it, and it just sears the left of your arm, and as it does so, you feel the many little pieces just grasp onto you and using the momentum of the hit it just grapples you in its tentacle.
<laughs> Looking at the chat. Okay, so Kriv, it's your turn. <laughs> okay, breath weapon. Um, make a D twenty for just a straight D twenty roll for me, real quick. How about a gay D twenty? That that does it. You can hit all three with your breath weapon. <laughs> I can if I recall correctly, it's an auto hit, so it's just they would roll for how much damage it does. Let me check your thing. Eight plus your constitution. So plus three. So they have to they have to succeed on a um dexterity saving throw and have to be an eleven or take the full damage. Okay, so go ahead and roll for damage. So they would take nine. The octopus to the left. Failed. So it's going to take the full nine damage. The octopus to the right. Rolled a natural 20. No damage at all. And the octopus in the middle failed, so full damage. Okay, can you do anything with your bonus action? And I'll rule that you can try to escape using your bonus action if you can't do anything else. You can rage, which will get you an extra, extra defense. You can frenzy, which could help with that disadvantage, but it would still hurt. Or you can do my rule, and you can use your bonus action to try to escape the restraint you're in. Okay, go ahead and make a dexterity check for me. Or dexterity saving throw. You don't get advantage because of the restraint, so it's just a straight roll. Yeah, Dinky, that's completely accurate. Yes, yeah, saving throw. Did I mute you all by accident? Or did you all just mute yourselves? Yeah, we all. Uh, yeah, no, I'm muting right now. So. Uh, by the way, I just have like from thirty uh, thirty minutes to an hour to an hour before I go to work, so I have not much time. Okay, no problem. Well, we'll be wrapping up soon. I plan to stop after this combat anyway. Yeah. Jolene is wanting a tent and is being loud for What's it. What's it? That's why. So not 20, which... Oh, so, no. Net 20 for the... Yeah, with minus one. <laughs> okay, um, make an unarmed strike damage for me. Three. 
So the damage to your barbarian form enrages you. And while it's not enough to actually cause your full rage that you're used to, it lets you burst out of the restraint. And in doing so, the raw strength of your arms actually inflicts damage upon this octopus who dare lay a, a tentacle on you. Okay, and that's the end of Kriv's turn. Unless you want to move Kriv, which I would not recommend. Okay, so now the octopus to the right is going to go. And I am so sorry, Kriv, but you are the only person visible to the octopuses. I am sorry. <laughs> you jump gonna... down. <laughs> <laughs> you can't. It's not your turn. <laughs> Twelve to hit. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Session. I just such a room, please. It missed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Noise. You're riding off of that little micro rage, and you just dodge the tentacle. To here, right? Just like it's a freaking annoying fly. And we get to Qualia's turn. Qualia's not participating in the combat, so you're just doing an investigation. Go ahead, if I call correctly. I'm allowed to call it to be do that? Oh, cool. If you, yeah, you could, remember, you have your, your legendary ability because of your ghost form. Legendary? Y'all. Wait, what? Once per um, round of combat, and you choose when, you can either inhabit a friendly within 100 feet of you and give them advantage on their next roll, or and you can attempt a constitution check against an enemy to see if you can possess them, and they would get disadvantage on, the next at on, on their AC for the next attack against them. Wait. But Wilson Corora back at the room. Yeah. Yep. Qualia is not. Qualia's character is not there. So Qualia, you're make an investigation check for me. Puggers. Yo, Nat twenty. Aces. Yep. Uh, I will discuss that with you next. Uh, Third eye open. Remember that. Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna message you that I have not pin it. Yep. Okay, um, Danny, it's your turn. Round two. Got it. I wanna, I wanna enchant ability to friend the Lionel. And then, yeah, uh, Lionel, what's your uh, strength, strength uh, modifier thing? Hmm. Leo, you're muted. Danke. Oh, and he's uh, sorry. What happened? Uh, what is your uh, strength uh, modifier? Plus two. Okay. Uh, would you use your? Uh, you're a you're a ranger. You're a correct. No, he's a. Line knows a rogue. He has a bow now. He's a rogue. Wait. When he is he does he have a bow crossbow? Yes. He has a bow sir. Yeah. Are you gonna attack? Uh, the 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 octopus that I weakened or at least did the twenty two damage on. Next, so I could sure, give you at I, least a, an enchant. So I, I want to enchant ability. Yeah, we'll, we'll an an octopus for that. Can you guys? Hear uh, me? I'm gonna. I want to give him the bull's strength. Like... The target has advantage on strength check, and his or her carrying capacity doubles. Oh, okay. can I do that? Um, purring up a storm. It wouldn't really be helpful in this situation, but sure. No, no. A pull, a pull strength, the target has advantage on uh, strength check. Isn't that yeah, what strength check? Isn't, if they use their bow, it's not a strength check. Oh, okay. You touch creature bestow next magic. Okay, then I'm gonna just give him level 2 bless. Can I bless Do you him? have any ranged healing? Uh, it, he is, uh, it says 30 feet. 
There's is near me. You can see, you can see Criff from here, and you you, you can see Criff is not can in the best condition. Can I actually? Wait, I have cure. Oh, no, wait, I can't cure wound her. She's it says hit touch. Uh, thirty feet. Okay, okay, fine. I wanna help. I wanna bless her. I don't know what. It's not. It's just like blessing. It's not. Uh... Does your strength check ability have a range? Have is it ranged? Uh, wait, what? The 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 spell that gives a strength check bonus, is it ranged? Oh, uh, no, it's a touch. Ah, it's okay. a touch. It has a an effect. It's a two d six healing, temporarily HP healing, but it's in in a touch. Mm. But I do have a blessing that like buff her. Wait, you plus up three creature within uh, the. Before spells end, can I at least try to give her a saving throw? So you want to like, use a remote give her an advantage? One? The blessing. It says here you bless up three creature of your show within range. Whenever a target makes an attack roll or a saving throw before the spells end, you can uh, roll a d4 and add the roll to the attack roll saving. Throw. I want to okay. do the second level, which is when you cast the spells using a spell slot of the second level. Get one addition can ish. You can target one additional creature for each slot level. Wait, what does that mean? Okay, I'm I'm popping into your character sheet. Hold on. Yes, the second level blessing. One additional targets. One additional targets. Is it just like make it from three to four creature? So instead of being able to bless three creatures, you can bless four if you use it at second level. Oh. So there will be like no more. Wait, is there anybody near her? Is she just the only one? Um hold on, I'm thinking in my head. You can see Lionel from there. Uh, you can wait. See isn't them. Lionel behind me? Uh, he is in the stairs. The further, yeah, you can or... see them from there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and you I can am... see all three of your front friends. So using it level one would be better. Okay, then then I want to bless uh, uh my my crew. I want to okay. bless up my friends. Here, level two. All of you are blessed. Uh, yeah, you. Yeah. And that's gonna be very people. helpful. I know. I thought it would be better at level four, level two, second level, because you know it's a second level. Are you going to do anything with your bonus action? No, I haven't. I just. I don't know. Can I? Uh... No, because you didn't. You used your action to do the bless. Yeah, I cannot do anything with the action. I don't know. Give me one second. I want to see what can I do. God, I wish if I have a crossbow. Now I think about it. But, <laughs> but crossbow would still be an action as well. <laughs> Belly will remember that. I don't know. Channel. I can channel divinity. Wait. Uh, I can. What is it? You can choose a divine domain that grants you additional. No, not this one. What is it? What is it? Preserve life is an action. You can uh, rest uh, restore. That's 50 an action. Oh fuck. Uh, racial traits, dark vision, keen sense. You you don't have anything you can do as bonus action. I check. I've already checked the thing. Okay. Okay, fine. I think. Oh that's... wait, no, I'm What's wrong. Up? What's oh, up? Oh man, I've been wrong about something the entire time. You can actually. It? Hold on, let me check your spell thing. Come on. Um, Please, you can actually it. cast your. You can actually cast your um, spiritual weapon as a bonus action and you use a bonus action to control it oh oh well that's no okay i wanna i got his uh, casting time wrong oh no no no. then can i cast it near uh rev or yeah. at least uh, i wanna i wanna use my i wanna pick her up with my spiritual weapon your with spiritual my... weapon can't take can't pick people up uh no it can uh, heal them correct you can use its touch to heal people yeah, can I do that? You've already used your action, so you'll be able to do that next turn, but yes. 
Okay. Okay. For, okay. okay. Uh, so, yeah. Spiritual. I want. I want. Yeah. Yeah. I want. Yeah. I want. I want my uh, spiritual weapon. Okay. Um, just for funsies, make a deception check for me. Oh no, deception. Deception. Mm-hmm. Wait. Why? I got fourteen. Okay. I'm I'm scared. What happened? What am I deception? What am I decepting? What am I lying to who? What am I tricking? Fail. I can't can hide and through. Wait, what what was the deception well, check? What? Fourteen. I got a fourteen. Fourteen. Oh, so the second one to fail. Misleading others or All fail. All three octopus think the bear is real. Real. Huh? Okay, so they're they're gonna focus on that fake bear. Fuck Not yeah. Not necessarily Wait. focus on it, but they think it's another opponent. So Krev is not the only one soaking damage now. Hey, congratulations! You're not a you're not dumb alone. <laughs> okay, so that's Danny's turn, unless he wants to move physically. Uh, mm, no, no, I don't think so. Okay, why no? I want to have a higher tower watch. Being a watch tower. What's up, Quick? You never stop hiding, by the way. Uh, uh so, no, I mean for the next turn. Yeah, Lionel, it's your turn. Help. Um. Oh, can I shoot? Hold on. Oh. You want to shoot with add, your bow? Yeah, let me add, add that to my inventory real quick. Is it a short bow? Uh, regular bow. Okay. And you uh, shoot in the left person. center or right one? Uh, which? What's the lowest? I kind of don't know. Uh, that would be the one that uh, Hammy hit. Oh, and also, you would get advantage if you targeted that one. All right, I'll go for that one. Also, I have a 1d4 as a gift. Yep, and at, you add a 1d4 to your hit as well. Um, so, uh, first step no... off, go ahead and roll it with advantage to hit. Wait, question, Billy. My, the one d four is it like he can use it again and again and again? It's not just yep. like one again time and thing. again and again. 26. Oh, so don't bother, shield. don't bother adding the d four. You hit. Go ahead and roll damage. That's that's a bully. Crit damage. I got net twenty. Oh, that was a net twenty. Oh, yeah. Oh, Jay. yeah. Jesus. That's that's crit damage. Sixteen. <laughs> Yeah, the the octopus in the middle, it is heavily wounded. Your your bow actually severed not one but two tentacles. Should I add a one d six for sneak damage too? Oh, that's right. Go ahead and add. Yeah, and then <laughs> two. It's crit damage, so that's actually four. Oh shit! Okay. Yeah, damage. it is hurting. It Let's is. Go. It's still alive, but it is uh, hurting. Can I hide again? Go ahead and roll stealth. Ah, oh, so close to an 18. Man. Nah, you're not stealth. Fuck. Am, am okay. I on the. Where, I'm on a high. Am I, am I high though? Yeah. You just tried. No, am I high, on high ground though, so they can't melee me? Oh, you're already there. Okay, sweet. Just good, man. The fourth level. Yeah. Yep. No. Okay, so the octopus you just wounded okay. is there, and in its delirium, it's gonna try to go after the bear, and that's an auto miss. Squid, it's your turn. Okay, so the metal squid is heavily wounded, like about to die. Yeah, there's blood okay. everywhere. Okay, if I do this right, I can do the sneak attack on one short sword and then use my bonus action on another short sword. Yep. I will do this. I will run to Metal's Octopus, and that's going to be my first hit. Let's see. 19, does that hit, I think? It, oh, that's 25, actually. Wait, I forgot the 6. <laughs> it's still all loading on my screen. What did you say was the total? 
25. That hits. Okay, perfect. So I do first the normal piercing damage, which has a 4. And, well, it's an 8, sorry. And then the D6, 8 and 5. How much is that? I'm bad at math. I, I'm, my brain's 13. not working right now. Okay, so that's the thing, yeah. How do you want to do this? Oh, this is a finishing blow. Okay, um. Indeed. And I just go right through its head. You charge from your hiding spot, readying your uh, short sword. And as you do get close to it, it tries to lash out with a tentacle. You jump on the tentacle and use it as a bouncing board and just strike your sword sword straight down through its skull in a clean blow and pull it back out again, readying towards the next target. I you like that? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so uh, now my bonus action, which is the two weapon fighting. Uh, with mm -hmm. my other short sword, there's two more, one on the left and one on the right, right? Right. The one on the left is currently engaged with Kriv. Okay, then I'm going for the one on the left. Alright, you get flanking damage because you were behind it thanks to that attack. So you actually get advantage on your attack. Uh, so I just roll with advantage when I'm doing the attack one. Yep. The, wait, the hit or the damage? The hit. The hit. Okay. Let me advantage. Roll. Oh my god, that's a nat twenty. Crit damage. Kill them. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's see. That's a 10. <laughs> and I'm going to say thanks to that nat 20. Go ahead and roll sneak damage. Oh my god. <laughs> that's a 17. Times that times 2. That's 14. So you did a total of 27 damage. You need to leave right now, Hammy? Oh my god. Minutes. What was that? Five minutes. And five, five minutes. minutes. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. I'll I'll continue for your character. It's not gonna, there's not going to be any plot afterwards. Uh, you said that there is a third. Uh, there's a three octopus, correct? Yep. One dead. One is heavily wounded, and the other is about half health. Okay. Can you do me a favor? I'm gonna leave right now. Mm -hmm. Danny, to focus on the here on the on the full, uh, with the with another guiding bolt level two. If it's okay, okay. To the half health one. No, 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 no. To the fully healed one. There's the only per... a half health and a heavily wounded. Oh, okay. To the half. To the half. Okay. Gotcha. You got it. Yeah. yeah. I I'm gonna leave now. So talk to you guys later. Okay. Bye. Later. Have fun at work. See you. Yeah. Okay. So the octopus that you just heavily wounded, Squeak, is gonna turn right back around at you and attempt to attack you. Okay. 14 to hit. I think hit. I have 15. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Kriv, it's your turn. Okay, go ahead and roll the hit. Do you, you do realize you're in melee range of one of them, right? Okay, go ahead and roll the hit. Okay, that is to 20 total. That definitely hits. Roll damage. And are, you, are you targeting the heavily wounded one or the half health one? Okie dokie. It's starting to lose consciousness, but it's still in the fight. Do you have anything you want to do with your bonus action? Okay. 
and the half helped octopus is also going to go after squeak okay <laughs> oh god 22 holy shit yeah that hits <laughs> okay you take 11 points of damage <laughs> and you are now restrained I am literally one shot kill at the moment. <laughs> I Damn. cannot take any more hits. I don't think. Yeah, there's a bunch of you that can't right now. Danny is going to use a level two uh, gunning bolt. That's 21 to hit. It hits. That's 23 points of epic damage. And that octopus is now heavily wounded. Not quite as wounded as the other one, but it's also breathing pretty hard. Lionel, it's your turn. Actually, um, hold on. Danny's oh. actually going to use his bonus action to attack that heavily wounded one with his uh, spiritual weapon. So, 17, that hits. Actually, that would be an advantage. So, I need to roll again. The first one's better. That was a damage of eight. Cammy just yeeted the octopus to the right straight to death. Nice. Uh, it's... The guiding bolt sears, hitting the creature directly in the skull. Barely it's alive. And Cammy's bear just follows up with a clean claw attack straight to the very spot where the guiding bolt had hit. Tearing the octopus's head straight in two. Okay. okay, Lionel. There's only one oh. octopus left. Well, I guess I'll shoot at it. Not <laughs> twenty. <laughs> Critical damage. <laughs> 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 How do you want to do this? Oh my god. <laughs> I go straight for its eye. I can do it. I'm just going to shoot straight into its eye. Well, it's got more than one eye, but I got what you're going. So you Fine. aim, okay, yeah. taking your time, and right as the octopus finishes trying to attack Squeak, you hit the... you press the trigger and the button and the bolt goes true straight through the octopus's eye and you can actually see the head of the bolt on the other side and the octopus just flops motionless on the deck nice sweet fucking bitch the cave crawlers have single-handedly <laughs> saved this ship from destruction are we sinking Nope. <laughs> okay, but without you guys, the crew was already finished. This op these octopus would have had a field day with anybody else on board. Can I go return the bow to whoever you know, who I stole it from? We'll be doing that next session. Okay. Yeah, that's where we're gonna end. It's a relatively short session, but hoo hoo boy. That was great. <laughs> you guys really pulled out all the stops this time around. I'm sorry, Crip. Literally nice everyone got an F20. Oh my god. We... To be fair, you, you handled taking on all three octopus like a champ there till your team could rally. Yeah, congrats. Thank you, Crip. Oh my god. 
You are the unsung hero tonight, Kriv. And then we've got Squeak and, Ham uh, and Danny here trying to compete for most damage done. I think <laughs> Hammy wins just because of that guiding bolt, though. Oh my god. Hmm. Oh, I'm on full HP, bro. Okay. Could you help me with something? Hmm. With a bunch of my string. What's up? Can you check my... And that's where we're in, Dan. I know, I was pretty checked out of it for the last part. I didn't really have much to do. But, I hope you enjoyed this. See you next time, fucker. <laughs>